Hey, good good morning, good morning everyone, good morning, nice and welcome back to uh, Madi. And I think this morning is very fresh. The sun rises perfectly, and it's very shiny as well. And see, everything around here is so fresh. Some mango trees, a lot of birds calling from the other side, and yeah. Today I'm gonna show you another video about where I am going to go this morning. I gotta walk around, uh, see if we have city again, and have fun. It's gonna be sweet. Everyone, you know, the best day. Good luck. Uh, right here is the national road number six, and the road still not finished yet since the renovation. As the governor planned to make it larger and bigger to welcome uh, the big tourists in the future so it is very close to the main uh, petrol station the Caltech petrol station which is close to the big hotel Sokka Simrib and uh, this main petrol station right here the Caltech which is very very uh, close in the city it is the most convenient where you can go and having some coffee and buy some snack or anything in that little mart over there and I will keep going along here uh, right now the Sivata street the, which is the main street that connected the city to uh, Anko what or Anko complex is being renovated as well and you still can see some big machine in the front and today the first of October there are so many vehicles and people driving and moving along this main street so as everywhere in Siem Reap downtown as the government just declare not to lock down the city anymore so people feel free to move around but they need to be aware about how to protect themselves from the covid wearing masks clean their hand with the alcohol and social distancing so the lucky mall right here is one of the mall in the downtown where you can go shopping but actually it's not really really big compared to the other country but it's very convenient because this is the main the main point after the lucky mall there is the shop around here So as the hotel this way and very interesting people they selling the fruits in this mobile cart for local people and the tourists that come from other country last time visiting Siem Reap you may find something very different because right here the road is still being re renovated and we hope that the city next year is going to be very pretty, especially the infrastructure right here is going to be improved. And we hope to have like the paved and clean road very soon this year. Uh, that one is the new shop. It's for the baby uh, product and item. So as that one also, the brand collection where you can get all of uh, the clothes, shoes, anything. And right now I am on the small street that connect from Sivata street the main road over there toward the river street which is at the eastern part of the Sivata and the street situated along the uh, Siem Reap stream or you call Siem Reap river that's uh, the only main river in Siem Reap town and the, the river also it connected to 
uh, Kulen Mountain, or we call the National Park of Kulen, to the Tunle Sap Lake. Siem Reap River, currently the water is not very fresh, and I think because of a lot of rain from uh, the north, which is like upstream, and bring all of uh, the unclear water to uh, the lower part, especially around here. But uh, back to the last 25 years, Siem Reap River used to be the main place where there are so many, many fish that local people can, you know, catch the fish or fish the fish from this small river right here in the Siem Reap town. And uh, my, my walking today, I would like to show you uh, some part of Siem Reap while we still uh, doing some construction and uh, road uh, renovation in the whole uh, town for 38 roads. So right here is called Watbo Bridge. This is the Watbo Bridge. I'm walking on this small bridge to get to the other side of the river. And right here, <coughs> there's the river to the north. You can see another bridge over there. That was the uh, colonial bridge from the French period. It's far from here. Not, not far from the Watbo Bridge to the southern part. It's around 200 meters. There's a big place, it's called Brown Coffee. Yeah, where you can get some nice coffee. <laughs> yeah, a little statue of the uh, Bayuan in Bayuan style ne just nearby the river right here everywhere still busy because of the machine uh, parking everywhere along each road in the city so maybe soon everything will be okay we can get our city nicely. So good. <laughs>